Good morning. <laughs> I know y'all hear Gracie Corner back there telling y'all good morning. Good morning, good morning, good morning, everybody. Today is currently July 30th, Sunday at 10 o'clock. Yes, it's Sunday and Tink is still here. She couldn't go with her dad this weekend. I'm not gonna put all their business out there, but just know her dad and her Gigi are super excited to see her as soon as possible. On Sundays, I normally do a lot of spring cleaning and just getting ready for Sonny to come back and restart the week. But since she's still here, I have to do it while she's here. She's not very happy right now. I don't know why she just woke up from a nap. Maybe the nap had a bad dream, but I put on some Gracie's Corner. She's quiet right now. She keep fussing, but nothing's wrong with her. I fed her, I changed her, I gave her her passy. She took a nap, like, she's A-OK, -okay, so if she start fussing, she just gonna have to fuss because I gotta get this stuff done. I've been in a little, little bit of a funk recently. I know they say your room and your space is a reflection of what's going on up here. So you guys gonna get a little glimpse. I got a lot of stuff to get done, reset my life, get my mind back on track, start feeling good about myself again. I did my hair just a little bit. It's kind of like a little simple style because I ain't have that much time. But the curls is kind of giving, so that's a start. I'm going to show you guys my room. I did already do some cleaning last night just because I have a lot to do. Sonny, watch Gracie, baby. But I did already start some cleaning last night just because I have a lot to do. I did Sonny's room last night. Okay, so first off, don't mind the mess you guys were cleaning up, but my mom went to the mall today and she got Sonny some new outfits and I have yet to see them. So this is gonna be our first time seeing them together. We're gonna do a quick little Carter's haul. So all of those clothes were so cute, but I forgot to mention, my mom also picked up this portable baby soother, which is pretty cool, seems pretty cool. It says it has four melodies and sounds. I guess it's to attach on the stroller or car seat for on the go. But maybe we won't have to listen to Gracie Corner everywhere we go. I'm gonna let you guys know how this works out and if this works. Y'all don't play with my baby shoe collection. She got the real Uggs at her dad's house. Her dad got them, so per. But these still cute. My mama got these Crocs from Gigi. Gifts, gifts. Yeah, don't play with her. Don't play with her. See, just wore these ones today, you guys. I'm going to insert some pictures of what she looked like on the screen. Because these are so cute. Here's the sizing right here. But look at these shoes. They're so adorable. So teeny. <laughs> Thank you. 
about the whole house today i need to get my car done but for one it's too hot out there so i really don't know if that's gonna get done and for two that's just like a whole extra process I watch a lot of other mom YouTubers and when they're cleaning, they have their baby on their chest as well. And I just want to say how, cause I'm tired already. This is a lot of work. So Tink was still tired, so I just put her down for another nap. That's why you may hear the lullaby music in the background. You guys, I have, well, Tink has a lot, a lot, and there's more over there. Tink has a lot of bottles, and, and she doesn't even like all of them. If the nipple is too flimsy, like this, she ain't gonna drink it because she has to suck harder and she just don't want to work for it. So she don't like these. So I'm gonna go through and organize the bottles that she does like. And I don't really know what I'm gonna do with the bottles that she doesn't like, but I know I'm gonna take them out. I tried once upon a child. I looked it up and see if they take the bottles. They do not. So if you guys know any places I can donate like baby bottles and pacifiers and stuff like that, let your girl know because I don't know. I don't want to. I mean, I could just go take them to the thrift store, but maybe if I can find like a pregnant women's shelter or something like that, that would be cool. <laughs> So Tink is now awake from her little cat nap that she took, huh? What was that, like 10 minutes? So you about to eat, eat huh? Y'all, it worked. You getting some milk? So now I can finish cleaning up and you can feed your little self, huh? Yeah. <laughs> so in here is the bottles that I decided to donate or give away or whatever I'm gonna do with them. And I organized her bottles up here so these are the ones that we're keeping these are the ones that she likes parents choice um dr brown's tommy tippy and abbott but all these other brands spectra nini supply playtex she don't mess with them so they got to go
How you doing, Stinky? Do you love it? Guys, if y'all want to shop, all these gadgets that I've been using in this video came from my recent Timu haul. So make sure y'all go check it out if y'all a first time mom, mom to be. Look at everything that I just got done, y'all. And she just being good and quiet and getting fed at the same time. If y'all gonna use it, make sure y'all do watch your baby. I was right over there at the sink. So I was like literally five steps away. Like I told you guys, she has a lot of pacifiers as well. And she only likes certain types. So a lot of these don't even get used. So I'm gonna go ahead and donate these. So this is literally all the pacifiers that I'm gonna keep. She only likes certain types. She likes this mama brand, which she also likes those bottles as well. Um, whatever brand this is, probably from Walmart, I don't know. And then she likes the Dr. Browns. <laughs> Okay guys, so it is now 4.30. I'm getting ready to lend Tink up some more food. In my last video, we did start giving Tink solids. If you guys haven't already checked out that video, it'll be in the eye above. But we had a old school blender we've had for years and it just wasn't doing the job. So my mom went and purchased this Nutribullet and when I tell you guys, it make it like liquid, it make it like liquid. So I be having to be real careful. We already tried bananas in the last video. Y'all know she loved them, so I'm gonna make her some more for in the morning. Morning. We have not tried apricots yet or apricots, whatever they're called, but I haven't even tried these myself. I don't even know what these taste like. And then we have not did any veggies yet other than carrots and she hated carrots. So we're going to try to do some potatoes. We got some red potatoes here. I'm going to boil two of them, skin them, and then I'm going to smash them up, add some milk, maybe a little bit of butter in there or something. Give it a little bit of taste, a little tang. So the potatoes are gonna take a little minute, so I'm gonna go ahead and get them on the stove first. So I cut up my potatoes and I tried to get as much skin off of it as possible because I didn't want any choking hazards. I cut them up into about four equal pieces per potato. Look at this y'all, ain't that crazy? Didn't we just wash dishes? As a mom, dishes never stop. <laughs> we'll get to those later. So next thing we got is the apricots. Like I said, I've never eaten these before. I don't even know what these are. I've heard of them. Skin, we're gonna rinse these off really quick and then skin them. Question, if I'm skinning them, is there even a point in rinsing them off? Like, I'm not even keeping the skin on it anyway. Look at Sonny over there being so good, y'all. What you doing, mamas? You playing? You're being so good, stick a butt. Now, so now that they're all skinned, I'm gonna go ahead and chop them up. I may have to put more of them in there just because they're so little. Sonia do not like the blender, y'all, so she may start crying, FYI. I gotta make some milk to put in there. I'll put in some water, bitch. I'm sorry, Sonny. Hold on. I'm trying to go fast. All right, you guys, so it looks like it is all blended up now. It, it looks a little too watery. I may have to put some more in there, but let's just go ahead and see. We got our containers. Yeah, it's real watery. And it stank. I don't know about apricots. How many apricots I gotta put in there? I told y'all I'd be making it real liquidy. Maybe I got a pulse instead of going full blast. I'm still learning, y'all. This ain't no tutorial. So this is where I got it. It's still real liquidy, but I'm tired of blending up apricot. So this is what we got right now. I may add it to like a bottle or something like that. She not gonna like me. That's not good. Let's just do bananas, cause I know she like bananas. And then I'm gonna do some peaches. Apricots, don't buy apricots, y'all. Apricots is nasty. Turn me inside out, make my heart beat. 
need no one else. You're all I need. Personality, everything you do makes me love everything about you. Your smile, your style, so fly. I can't deny. So we got a new member. She's gotten really clean lately. So she's scared of the blender. So I don't know why she wanna be over here with me with the blender. We're gonna just do this last little bit of peach and call it a day. Looks pretty good to me, y'all. So we got apricots, peaches, and bananas. Oh, and the potatoes when they get done. Let's check them, actually. Go ahead and put these in the fridge. So the potatoes are done. I'm gonna try my best to pour it as slow as possible so it don't splash. So this is the rest of the six ounce bottle that she didn't drink. So I'm gonna go ahead and mix it in here so it can get a little creamy. Yeah. So her mashed potatoes are done real creamy. She may actually eat this for dinner tonight. So dirty. <laughs> I can never have no alone time, y'all. But it's okay. Say we attached, Tom. Huh? Okay, guys. So we are on the road on the way to the mall right now. I didn't get to finish recording my little self-care hygiene routine. I'm just going to do a whole completely separate, different video for that. Revolving around personal hygiene after a baby. So like postpartum hygiene routine. Because... 
when I tell you, like, this may be TMI, but like, we family. So I feel like I can tell y'all, but after you have a baby, I've heard a lot of women say this, myself included, yo older is like, to the max like top tier i could go out all day i mean temperatures have risen but after pregnancy it's just like your hormones gotta like get adjusted back to how it was prior to pregnancy and that can take a while so it's like i could go outside i used to be able to go outside like maybe forget the odor and i would be good gucci no sweat no smell now baby now we gotta keep the hygiene products on deck. Speaking of the car, I didn't get a chance to clean out the car yesterday in my whole little cleaning montage. I finished my room and I finished Sonny's room and I did all the organizing and stuff that I need to do. I still gotta update you guys on that. everything in here like everything i have i use like it be coming in i got like a pair of shorts some crocs some slides i got a comb an edge brush like i got everything in here y'all it's like i'm living out of my car but i be needing this stuff like i be using it i promise you i be using it so it's like i'll take out my head scarf out of here and then my hair start looking a mess at work i go to my car and look for a hair scarf no head scarf and it just be making me upset so like somebody had commented about my car being dirty mind yours because if you're not gonna clean it then hush also a little update on my birth control long period thing still on it still light still no cramping but when i went to my OBGYN, they gave me the birth control pills so i've been on what is it next next blah next i don't know what it's called but i've been on some um some little pills and um so far it ain't working he told me to give it a month i said um, i think he said three months actually but i said a month what are you talking about i have been taking it every day i just ain't been taking it at the same time it'd been like a couple of hours here and there it'd be like i'll take it at seven today maybe nine tomorrow maybe eight the next day do that matter let me know do that matter i'm still taking it every day it's just not it's just a couple hours behind a uh, head. You know what I'm saying? Going to the mall, like I said, we gotta buy some more sleepers because your girl is long. Anything that has footsies, she just grow out of like that. So we're gonna go get a couple of little onesies and we're gonna end off this little Sunday reset. Even though it ain't Sunday no more, it's Monday. Hey. <laughs> But yeah, you guys, I just had to get back on my Zoom real quick because I have not been taking care of myself, you guys. I have gotten real lazy, just like in a depressed state. Not like a super depressed state of mind, but more like just depressed state of reality. Like I was I, I just taking in everything that's going on in life and just being okay with it and learning to just go with the flow, which I've been getting real good at, you guys. I've been real good with just taking life one step at a time make me feel better you know my skin glowing hair curling i feel cute and natural it's just a good day y'all
Oh, that is so cute. This is the cutest. y'all we got a couple of onesies not too many sleepers though we don't got no six months really Oh, right in budget. 